Hey guys, it's me, Edward Vane, and let's talk about the Yeezy Bread. Alright guys, let's go. Now, the Yeezy Bread is probably one of the most famous Yeezys out there. This was the first Yeezy version to out there. It even had a re-release this 2020. I just got this pair this month, and I have to say I absolutely love it. It's because it's a simple Yeezy design. It's black, it has the... Saint Pablo loves you over here, you know, black and red. It's very noticeable. And this was the first Yeezy to have a pull tab compared to the other Yeezys that came before it. Okay. Now I also have the Yeezy Copper over here. Okay. So as you can see, this one has no pull tab. And the difference of this is the difference of the bread and copper is of course the paint stripe. There's a paint stripe here with, you know, small sprays of paint over here all throughout the shoe and the bread is actually quite quite darker than the copper and the easy red easy oreo and easy olive yeah so this was like the og pair of yeezy of the version 2 okay and it's pretty expensive as well and pretty simple but very noticeable a lot of hype was in this shoe especially on its re-release and all in all, I just think I love it. This is one of my favorites. You know, it's a very simple Yeezy, and it's black, so you could pair it off with any kinds of jeans, especially black jeans, but you can pair it off with blue jeans, red pants, or white pants as well. Yeah, it's pretty amazing. So I got this off the, the net. I was able to cop this. If you guys want to buy or try to buy it, I'll put a link below. And on feet, it feels so comfortable. Yeah. Now, the main difference of this version or this pair compared to the pair years ago is I don't know, I think it's, you know, much cleaner and the fit is better because if I wear my copper, there's a slight difference when I wear it. Yeah, I think this one is more comfy. It has the same size. I think it's because of the design because, you know, since it's re released, it had, you know, small modifications, but I can't really describe that to you as of now. I've only got this shoe for maybe around three weeks. I've wore it maybe four times, okay, but I love it. And I have to say, if you're able to cop or if you're able to find a supplier that sells the Yeezy bread, you gotta buy it if you're a Yeezy fan. And even if you have already, you know, a Yeezy, bre a Yeezy red, copper, olive, or Oreo, I think this will feel very different because of its simplistic design and because of its, you know, light but very noticeable shade of red text of SPLY350. And of course, the all famous pull tab. This was the first shoe that had a pull tab. Mm -hmm. So thank you so much for watching my video guys. And if you like more shoe reviews, please subscribe or comment below. And I'll see you guys in my next video. See ya!